Welcome to Kodu Game Lab. This tutorial will show you some of the basic tools in Kodu by adding objects and programming them to interact. This Kodu Basics tutorial will show you how to add an object, Kodu, and program it to eat other objects. In this tutorial, it will be apples. First, you'll launch Kodu Game Lab and then choose Load World. Next, you can use the arrow keys on your keyboard to select the worlds, or you can use the arrows on your screen and click on them with your mouse. We're going to choose New World, and then select Play. You are now looking at the canvas in which you will create your game with. Notice that at the bottom it says press Escape on your keyboard to edit, so I'm going to click Escape. The tools in which to work on your canvas are below. We're going to go and select Object Tool. This will allow us to put an object onto our canvas. When I click the canvas, my options will appear. You'll notice that some of the options or objects give you additional options, such as the tree. In this tutorial, we're going to add a Kodu. Now that I have a Kodu on my screen, or an object, I can right-click on him and select Program. You will see a line that has When and Do. Notice that there is a plus sign next to each of those words. This is how we will program our objects. I'm first going to click on When, and I'm going to choose C. To elaborate on that, I can click the plus sign additionally, and I can say when he sees anything. Now I'm going to tell him what to do when he sees something. I'm going to tell Kodu to move, and in addition, I'm going to tell him to move towards that thing that he sees. If I click the escape key, this will return me to my canvas, where I can then choose from my toolbar to, to play this scene out. Notice that Kodu is not moving anywhere, because he doesn't see anything. So I'm going to click the escape key to go back to edit. This time, I'm going to click the object tool and add additional objects. So I'll go to my canvas. I'll click on it. This time I'm going to add an apple. I'm going to add 10 apples total, and I can add them to different parts of my canvas by clicking on those parts. Now I'm going to go back to Kodu. I have to make sure that my object tool is selected and I'm going to right click and I'm going to program some more. This time I'm going to do the programming in the second line. Now I want to tell him that when he moves towards those objects, I want him to bump into them. And then when he bumps into them, I want him to eat them. Now when I go back to return to my edit mode by clicking Escape, I'm going to click Play. This time you'll see Kodu is moving towards the objects that he sees, the apples. He's eating them. When he's finished eating them, you'll notice that Kodu stops moving because he no longer sees any objects. I hope this basic tutorial has been helpful in understanding Kodu game labs.